Hammerwatch is a top-down dungeon crawler developed and published by Crackshell. It is a very interesting dungeon crawler with six different classes to choose from, and uh, four levels, each including their own boss fights and their own challenges. I can't recall a time where we were playing and we did not have just barrels and barrels of fun. The game is designed between one to four players, and your goal is to make it to the castle and defeat this grand dragon. It's all very amazing. It's very light on the story, which I think fits the gameplay really well. Our playthrough, we decided to play with four players. Um, we went with the, your typical MMO setup. We had a paladin, a thief, an archer, and then a cleric. So we had the full setup for damage and tanking and healing. And it worked out really well. And we could also see where the game could be played solo as well. It gives away to this massive, this massive simple complexity that the game sort of hosts. And it helps out with everything else in the game. Something really cool about this game is that you would purchase all of your upgrades from different vendors that were placed around the map. Some were hidden, some were just right out in the open. The ones that we saw, we recognized the most were outside of like the first boss chamber and it would introduce you to what each merchant does and how each of them fit into the game. Among these upgrades, they also introduce a combo system where if you kill a certain amount of enemies within X amount of time, you activate a combo, and each class can get their own unique abilities for this. I found the Thief was incredibly fun uh, while I was playing him, as well as the Cleric combo was surprisingly good as well. And I have to say the Cleric is probably my favorite class in this game, just because he does have a healing Kamehameha, and it's hard to beat out a healing Kamehameha that can also hit undead enemies for massive amounts of damage. If you're looking into getting this game, I do highly recommend it, and I also highly recommend playing with your friends. It is incredibly fun with your friends. One thing to consider is that there are no targeted abilities in this game. Everything has to be aimed, um, so it gives way to a lot of proper positioning and stuff, and we, <laughs> we actually had a really fun time um, trying to get everybody healed up. We would force everybody uh, against the wall and we would all start shouting uh, in chat at each other, hands against the wall, you need to get healed, hands against the wall! And it was an absolute blast, an amazing, amazing little fun dungeon crawler that comes highly recommended from me, it comes highly recommended from Steam as well, it almost has nothing but good commendations from various reviewers and various developers, and for what it costs it is so many hours of fun and we're looking to go back and play through it again. It also has some recently released DLC. I am looking forward to any more content that these developers push out for this game. It definitely gets my recommendation.